What's supposed to happen today is presidential consultations with uh, President Michel Aoun. And the way that the sectarian power sharing system works here is that the prime minister must be a Sunni Muslim, but he has to be nominated, agreed to by all the different parliamentary blocs from the different sects and parties. And there's supposed to be this meeting that happens in which each of them agree that they will nominate or agree who they will nominate and that the person with the largest number becomes prime minister. Now, this has been ongoing since October 29th when Saad Hadidi resigned. The country has been under a caretaker government as the economic crisis here continues, the political crisis continues, people feel nothing is being done by the government. On two occasions, it's looked like they had managed to find another candidate for prime minister. And at the last minute, the first candidate pulled out because he felt support that protesters were against him. They were protesting outside his home. And in the second instance, he pulled out the candidate because the main Sunni authority in Lebanon said that he would prefer for Saad Hadidi to come back. So that second candidate pulled out last week. That means that these consultations have been repeatedly postponed and people are getting angrier and angrier. One possibility today, very likely, is that they could be postponed once again. That, of course, will fuel more protests because people are increasingly angry that they feel nothing's being done. Or that Saad Hadidi has resigned again. He looks like the only, uh, sorry, is pointed again. He looks like the only viable candidate at the moment. But once again, protests are saying they will absolutely not accept that. That is a return to the status quo. And we're now starting to see some of the political parties as well saying they will not back Hadidi. The two main Christian parties in parliament yesterday said they wouldn't nominate him. And it's possible that if he is nominated today as a result, that the president will say, well, we don't have all the sects supporting him, so we can't. So that's what we're looking forward to today. And we'll see his react to whatever happens.